Go back to your Antera account web page and select the folder with uploaded documents. Make sure you select the correct folder for which you have configured the integration. For this lesson we have uploaded some more documents for recognition and now we will see how to export all of them at once. Before you start exporting documents, you can make some additional settings to your folders. You can add or remove columns to your folder to make it look more convenient and adjust it to your needs. Press on the gear icon in the right part of the screen. You will see the list of available entries. For example, you can add export state or document amount. Also, you can remove the tax rate in case you do not need it to be displayed in the list of documents in this folder. Now let's go back to the documents expert. It is recommended to upload more than one document for recognition and export documents at bulks. Select several documents you would like to export to your tally. And click on the Export to External System button. You will be forwarded to the matching menu. This menu helps you to make sure the entries in the documents will be exported correctly. In the left part of the matching menu, you can see the list of your selected documents for export. In the right part of the matching menu, there are fields for your entries taken from your accounting system. You need to fill in the ledgers for the voucher type of each document, select the document category, select the supplier and the ledger for items in case you work with purchase or sales inventory vouchers. You can also use the mass selection in case the majority of the exported documents are of the same voucher type and have the same transaction type or have the common supplier. You can select ledgers for each document one by one or in case all of your documents or most of them belong to the same type, let it be purchase category for our scenario. It is recommended to use the mass selection function to save your time. Press on the field checkbox in the top left part of the page and select all documents. Now you can see that the additional menu has been opened in the right part of the page, which is called Belt Actions. Now you can select the transaction type, its category, and sometimes it's also required to select company or tax registration. After you have filled in these fields in the bulk actions additional menu, click on the apply button. Now you can see how easily and fast all the selected entries has been autofilled with the help of this mass action function. Now it's only left to select the ledgers for suppliers. In case you don't have any of required ledgers created in your tally yet, you can create the new ledger from the recognized. As for our scenario, let's create the ledger for the supplier. Click on the Supplier field for the first document and select the Create Company from Recognized. When you create a new ledger for a supplier from Recognized, it is also required to specify the currency. All those entries that need to be filled in are highlighted with red color for you to not miss any of them to fill in. Usually for the following expert it will take you less and less time to fill in these entries as the system will be automatically filling them in for similar documents. Now as you have finished filling in all the entries, you can click on the button Create Documents. After that, go back to the connector and click on Get Docs button. 
In case all the required ledgers in the connector are filled in correctly, you will see the successful state of documents export, which is displayed in green color. After documents are successfully exported, you can now check how they will be displayed in tally. Find the exported documents in your tally and check their content. The document was exported and being displayed in tally correctly. Now it's your time to practice. Please try to export documents to your tally system. Share with us your experience or in case you have any questions, ask for our help. You can find our contacts in the description of this video. Also, you can visit our website enteraglobal.in and contact our support team by the email or in WhatsApp. In case you would like to request a call back, click on the Help option in your Entera account web page and fill in the form for a return call from us. In case you would like to dive deeper into learning more about the Entera's features, you can access our knowledge base. Here you can find various short useful articles from how to create a new folder to how to connect to your accounting system or using the mass selection function in Documents Expert. That's it for now. Thank you for being with us today. Press like if you enjoyed this video and we will see you in our next lessons.